everybody, it's me Flavieski or Caitlin and uh, today I'm joined with my brother even though he's not gonna talk but we are gonna show you guys the some secret locations on Potter World MC so uh, you might not consider these secret but some of them are and not everybody knows how to get there so we're gonna show it to you so the first one we're gonna show you guys is not that that big of a deal but it's gonna be the restricted section in the library. So first we're going to show you the library and show you the restricted section and how you can't get in there. So, okay, like I was saying, if you go all the way down here, there's this area that you're unable to get to and it's the restricted section and you see that it's all fenced up and so honestly there isn't really a purpose to going in there but we want to show you anyway because there is a way to get in there so you just go to the great hall and you're going to want to go over here and go up the stairs okay <laughs> and then you, you go all the way up here so you see you see this window thingy you're going to want to use resist momentum so that you don't take fall damage okay so my brother just made it so we're going to try again and hopefully not die Okay. Also, I have a rant. I have a complaint, Potter World MC. Why'd you change the Resist Momentum spell? It used to make you be able to fly, but now you can't fly. Okay, so I finally made it. So you're just gonna want to go into this painting. Woo! We did it. So, see my brother. And so we just go keep walking, and you'll get teleported. And you're gonna be like, wait, what is this? If you look, it's the restricted section of the library. So that was our first location. So now we could uh, see how to get to the Phoenix base. Okay, quickly, to show you guys how to get out, you, you would spawn right here. So you just keep going and going. And there's a painting right here. And you just go inside the painting. And it should take you outside. If you uh, come out of the restricted section and you go right here, and you go into this room with Ovamora, there's a cake. So guys, for the second uh, location, which is the Phoenix base, you're going to want to go anywhere with the fireplace network. And you're going to want to go to the dwelling or the burrow. This one. The dwelling, aka the burrow. The Weasley's place. And you're going to want to go out here. And you're going to want to turn and, yeah. and go to this tent oh it's already open would you look at that so there would be a devil snare right here and you're gonna have to use um lumen Astius. but for some reason the devil snare isn't here anymore but you're just gonna go in here and right click and voila you're in the phoenix space and um there are stuff that you could get here like a phoenix brownie, which is somewhere inside there, in a chest. Third <laughs> and final location, which is Askewan. It's going to be quite a journey, but um, it's possible. So you're going to want to make sure you have a broom, and it is required. So not only does it make it more helpful, but it is required. So you're going to want to fly around here. And you're going to want to try to find the herbology things. Like, I, I don't know what it's called. The greenhouses. Yes, try to find the greenhouses. As you can see, we've reached the greenhouses right here. So then you turn this corner, and so then you're going to get off. Well, you, yeah, get off. And then you're going to see this little dome thingy. So you're going to go through here. You're just going to keep going and going. And you can do this all by foot, but remember, you go, from here you just go straight. You can go by foot, but it's going to take a while, so we are going to use brooms. 
And so once you see this water, you could go ahead and get off. Because I don't know if you could fly through the portal. Oh, you can fly through the portal. I don't, I don't know. Don't yeah. try it. Don't, don't try it. I'm not going to try it, but you just walk through and it should teleport you to the wilderness. Once you go here, you should have it uh, added to your port key bag. So then you're going to spawn this way, right? You're just going to turn right and go this way. And you could, like I said again, use your broom because it's way much more quicker. And you're going to go over this mountain. And just keep going. Just go through these trees. Try not to crash. And eventually you should see water. And so then you're going to see this uh, ship. You should recognize it as a Durham Strange ship, I believe. I hope I'm not wrong. Um, and then there's Captain Jack. And so this is a portal, so you could just walk through it. And voila! We've made it to Azkaban! So guys, that's uh, our video on three secret locations in Potter World MC. Uh, they might not be super duper secret, but I just wanted to make a helpful video in case you guys didn't know how to get to any of these locations. Now you know how. Thanks for watching. Bye!